Hello everybody and welcome to a brand new Gentech PC product showcase. Today we're going to be showing you the brand new ASUS S56CA. This is basically the new successor to the old N56 series. So it's a standard everyday performance laptop that is based on being very thin and very light. However, the new S56 series is even thinner and lighter than the old N56 and it also is now available in both Windows 7 and Windows 8 configurations. So to get things started, we're going to go ahead and start with unboxing the unit. As you can see, it will be shipped in a double boxed state. This protects it very well during shipping, so no scratch damage, no shock damage. It's very well protected. The boxes are no longer showy and flashy. They're very ergonomic to help save on environmental waste. These are the green boxes. When you open up the inner box, you're gonna go ahead and see right away, you have the laptop on top. So we have some cardboard here to help hold everything in place. And right below it is the laptop inside of a protective sleeve. When you take a first look at the S56, you're going to see that it does have a very wide, very flat and thin profile. It's only 21 millimeters thick and yet still has the full 15 inch laptop diagonal size. Unlike many very ultra thin laptops, this one still does have an optical drive. Now further down in the box, below the laptop, you're going to find a little concave area that has all of the manuals, warranty information, all the standard things you would expect to get with a brand new laptop. And now surrounding that in all the various little hiding spots, you're going to have your power cable. This is a two part power brick. It has one part that plugs into the laptop with a removable power cord that will plug into the wall. And up above that, here's the other part of that we were talking about. This is the power cable. On the bottom side, this is where we're going to find our battery. This particular battery here is a four cell battery. It's not very large, but it has enough capacity to help carry the hardware for a while since it is a low power consumption unit. Now we have the battery inserted in the laptop out for display. You can go ahead and take a 360 degree look at what the unit looks like with the lid closed. And now a closer look to show you all the ports. On the front, we just have status LEDs. Over to the right hand side, we have a single headphone jack that is a combo for both the microphone and headphones two USB 2.0 ports, and then our optical drive. And then finally in the back is the Kenningston lock port. On the back, also no ports, it's flush. You just have the battery here. And over to the other side, we have where the power cable is gonna plug in, the exhaust vent, your VGA output, your HDMI output, ethernet port, and your single USB 3.0 port. Now with the lid open and the unit turned on, First thing you'll notice from the gleaming light is that there is a really nice finish here on the lid. This is an aluminum finish with a glossy ASUS logo. Inside you'll see that we have a glossy screen and the chiclet style keyboard. Again, this particular unit is running Windows 7, but you can get it configured in Windows 8 as well. Above the LCD screen, you will find your high definition webcam and the holes to help with the internal microphone to pick up sounds. Taking a closer look at the keyboard area, you have your power button on the top left, and then you have the full layout for the chiclet keyboard, including a full number pad and arrow keys. The keys are slightly recessed to help keep the unit closed without the keys sticking out, and while they might look like they're backlit, these are not backlit keys. To the front center, you have your oversized touchpad with the left and right clicks included inside of the touchpad. So just touch the corresponding corners. Here's all the labels for the status LEDs that you can see in the front. 
And also this entire inside area is also made out of aluminum. So having a pretty much a fully aluminum body, low profile, ticket style keyboard, very professional presentation. You can see here on the badge it does show you that it has 21 millimeter thickness and that it is made out of scratch resistant aluminum. Here's a look at some of the hardware. Two of your most important things to look at are your graphics, and in this case we're running the Intel HD 4000 integrated graphics, and your CPU, and in this case we're running a full quad-core Intel i7 CPU at 1.9 gigahertz on each core. For the screen information, you can see over here that the resolution is 1366 by 768. This is an LED backlit LCD screen. As for the performance scores given to us by the Windows WEI index, we got a 5.1 based on our lower score, which is the graphics. Being that it's an integrated graphics card, you can't expect too much out of it. It will get you through all your day-to-day -day tasks and some very light gaming, but nothing extraordinary as far as high-end gaming. And now with the unit turned over, you can see what the bottom looks like. You do have quite a few vents opened up inside of the bottom of the casing to allow air into the system to cool the components. All the vents that you see on the bottom are intake, except for here on the side, this is your exhaust. And now there is a provided access door here that makes it easy for users to access the inside of the system to do user upgrades. On the side, you have very easy access to your hard drive so that you can upgrade it to a different capacity or to a solid state disk. And further over, you have access to some of your RAM. And now the last thing we're going to be doing is weighing in the unit so you can expect to know how much to carry around with you. Right now, this is the laptop alone without the battery. And now with the battery weight added on. And finally, if you also include the charger. And that everybody is going to conclude our video for taking a first look at the new Asus S56. We hope that you found our video both entertaining and useful at the same time. Of course, if you'd like to learn more information on the S56, all you have to do is visit our website, gentechpc.com. On our site, we have full product specifications, current pricing and availability, customized ordering. If you need any additional help with the unit, feel free to contact us by phone or email. And we also have our own computer forums that you can always ask questions on as well. So thank you very much for watching our video. Once again, this is Gentech PC, and we'll see you next time.